Start with four people shot in the same area of Lake County in two separate shootings just hours apart, and now one person has died. And both police and city officials say this is very unusual for quiet, usually quiet, Mount Dora. Good evening to you. I'm Eric Von Anken. Thanks for joining us tonight. The first shooting was last night in a Walmart parking lot, the one on 441 in Mount Dora. Both of those victims were flown to the hospital. The second shooting, that's the deadly one, was early this morning just a mile away on a street called Sheridan Road. Police think that one stemmed from a wild party called a rave. News 6's Amanda Castro is at that scene. This is the second shooting in Mount Dora in a period of five hours. The first happening at a Walmart not too far from here. And then this fatal scene where deputies say the victims were coming from a large rave. Now law enforcement is trying to figure out if the two shootings are connected. This quiet neighborhood on Sheridan Road turned into a crime scene overnight. Neighbors saying they heard what sounded like gunshots. I didn't know what it was. I thought it was fireworks, but I heard it like constantly. When Lake County deputies arrived, they found this silver car and two gunshot victims. One victim was dead inside the vehicle, the other injured, laying in a nearby driveway. We believe that this shooting scene was connected to that rave. We're still checking into that, though, to verify. Sergeant Jim Fashan tells News 6 the victims attended a rave called Project X last night at this nearby banquet hall. They say up to a thousand people from across the area were bussed in for the party. Investigators believe the victims were shot sometime after the rave ended, but they don't know how they ended up here. We're still trying to figure that out. The car was actually reported stolen out of Tampa. Um, so we're, we're surmising that the, these individuals stole the car in Tampa, drove it up to this rave. So at some point, the violence happened at the, uh, at the rave. It spilled out onto this roadway here. Hours earlier, Mount Dora police worked its own double shooting in the Walmart parking lot. The suspects got away. Police don't think it's related to the fatal shooting, but the sheriff's office says they're looking into it. We'll be working with the Mount Dora Police Department on that to see if there is a connection. But Sean adds two shootings in Mount Dora within hours of each other is very unusual. Now, this very quiet area is very unusual for this kind of thing to happen. In Lake County, Amanda Castro, News 6.